Hello, I'm Paul Dolan of Cybex International, here with Dr. Paul Juris, Executive Director of the Cybex Institute for Exercise Science. Dr. Juris, on numerous occasions, customers come out of a product demonstration with you saying, I had no idea so much research went into the development of Cybex equipment. Would you explain the goals of the Cybex Institute in relation to product development? Sure, Paul. Cybex takes great pride in building products that deliver unmatched results with minimum joint stress. And it's the responsibility of the Cybex Institute to fulfill that promise. Well, anyone can say that. How does Cybex accomplish it? Well, we take thorough and exhaustive measures on all of our products before they enter the manufacturing process. Measuring things like force and motion and muscle activity allows us to understand how the products are working so that we can modify them or optimize them in order for them to do exactly what we want them to do. Can you give us some examples of exactly how you measure force and muscle activity? Sure. For example, we use a highly specialized instrumented foot plate that measures ground reaction forces, or in the case of the arc trainer, pedal reaction forces. These measures help us understand the magnitude and the direction of the forces that are being generated while somebody's on the arc. This way we can modify the movement pattern of the arc and create the optimal load balance between the hip and the knee. Then we use something called electromyography, or EMG, which is a system that measures muscle activity. By looking at muscle groups while they're working, we can determine that they're working to the extent that we want them to, so that when we say you're really working your glutes when you're on the arc trainer, it's true because we've measured it. You've talked about the arc trainer, but what about strength products? Are there other kind of measurements the Cybex Institute applies to Cybex strength equipment? Absolutely. We do something called a kinematic or emotion analysis on all new strength concepts. By measuring changes in limb position or joint angle, we can see how different designs affect the user. Why is that important? Well, a strength product that's too narrow or too wide could have a real negative effect on movement strategy. So we want to make sure that we're designing products that, even if they're changed by one centimeter, are going to deliver the right experience for the user. That sounds like a lot of work. Wouldn't it be easier to take a new idea, build it, and just see how it feels? Well, sure, that would be easier, but it certainly wouldn't be better. And we won't compromise on the quality of the experience that someone has on our products and the outcomes and benefits that you get from our products. And it's my job to make sure we never do. Thank you, Dr. Juris. From the Cybex Institute for Exercise Science, I'm Paul Dolan. Have a great workout.